Hello everyone. In today's video, I am going to explain you how to download C software, install it and then execute a simple C program. Let's get started. So, for downloading the C software, just open your web browser and type www.turboc8.com in your address bar and click on enter. And then you will be navigated to a web page like this. So, in this web page, click on download tab. So, under downloads, you will be having some list of software for various operating systems. Right? As you can see here, this C software is for Windows 10 64-bit operating system. But, but my system is Windows 8 64-bit operating system. So, I am scrolling down. So, we can see here, right? So, this is the C software for Windows 8 64-bit operating system. So, I am going to download this. By downloading the software, make sure that you download it through direct download link. For avoiding unnecessary web pages to pop up, you can download it through direct download link. Okay, my software is being downloaded. So, as I am having a zip extractor app, instead of downloading, it is showing me the contents of the zip file directly. So, without this app, if you are trying to download, then you will be navigated to a page like this, where it will show you the progress of the download. So, can you see here? So, your software is being downloaded. So, I am going to open it. Download. download is completed. I am going to open. So, this is the C software, which is a GIF file. I am going to extract the contents. Extract all. Extract. Once the contents are extracted, just open the folder and here you, you could see the C software which is an exe file. So for installing the software, just double click on this exe file and you will get a pop up like this asking you to allow for making changes to the computer. Click on F. Click on next. And accept the agreement. Accept the agreement and click on next. Click on next. Your software is being installed. So, and click on finish. Okay. So, C software has been successfully installed. Right. So, once your software is installed, you can see a shortcut like this on your desktop. So, I am going to open it and execute a simple C program. So, my C software is successfully installed. That is the reason why I am getting this screen. So, I am going to open a new blank file. Click on new. So, this is the place where I am going to type my C program, right? So, for now, I am just writing a simple program for displaying my text welcome on the output screen. So, for doing that, at first, I am going to write hash includes, hash includes stdmo.h. So, this is the header file which supports printf and scanf function and I am going to write my main function. So, void, I am taking the return type as void, main. So, inside my main function, I am going to write the actual logic for printing the message. So, for printing, for displaying anything on the output screen, I will make use of the predefined function which is printf. Printf, inside the double quotes, I have to specify. Welcome everyone. So, this is the message which I want to be displayed on the output screen. 
okay so this is my simple c program right as i have written the program what i have to do is for getting the output first i should compile my program so for compiling my program i can do it here using this tab or i can use alt f9 shortcut so my program has been successfully compiled and what i have to do now is i have to run my program so for running my program i can do it here or either i can use control f9 shortcut key so i'm going to use the shortcut key control f9 my program has been successfully run and for getting the output i should press on alt f5 shortcut key so can you see here i have successfully got the output welcome every one press on any key and again you will be navigated to the program so for exiting from this ide you have to click on uh, either alt x or you can do it type exit this is how i can install a c software and execute a simple c program